I can't hear. In the way, I've kind of got to squat. Hi, Dose Daily. I'm in the park with Lewis. Who's <laughs> yeah, he's interrupting my day again. Naughty, naughty Lewis. I like being naughty, man. I've got my dog between my legs. Hi, man. Okay. Ah. Yeah, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm sat up here. We just ate ice lollies. I'm the healthiest because I ate two pineapples. As in, <laughs> for ice cream, not two whole pineapples. Because that would be very. Well, I don't know how to fit them in. You have to like unhinge your jaw to like a them. fish. I no, can't unhinge my jaw. Yeah. I have a dodgy joint. Okay, anyway. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Sorry, there's an aeroplane. Oh my god. And then it bursts into flames. No. I'm using Lewis's camera today. Woo! Because I don't even have one. I'm, I'm going to buy one oh. on Friday. Woo! Woo! We're kind of locked out as it happens. I've got to wait for my mum to get home before we can get back in. So I've got my key. And I'm a bit worried about my dog because he's black. And <laughs> <laughs> Get hotter, I'll take a shot just so it's not out completely. Oh, got his bum. I took a shot of his back for you. Thanks. His neck, his back, his neck, his back. And then there's a crack. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, so the theme for this week, Lewis, is uh, weird facts that I know. Okay, I don't know any. <laughs> <laughs> weird facts that I know. Pineapple lollies are the healthiest. Yes! Yes. Yes, pineapple lollies are the healthiest. Well, only if you buy them from the co-op. Yeah, black currant comes second, strawberry come last for some reason. Strawberry are the most least, most least healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm just trying to work that out um, of my head. What facts do I know? Weird ones. Weird facts. Weird. I don't know. No, neither do I. Um, Matt cause... Lewis used lots and lots of club card vouchers to buy his camera. Yes, that is, well, my mum did actually. It was quite correct. That, the spider myth, <laughs> the one where you eat eight spiders in your sleep, that's actually false. Is it? Yeah. No. Nice. Somebody made it up to prove that people believe things that are made up. Hmm. Mind you, it's the whole um, illusion of truth thing. The more you hear something, the more you believe it's true. Exactly. Like hearing that Justin Bieber's good. Why are you looking at me like that? I never said he was good, I just said he was fit. Um, that if there's more people around and somebody like falls over and like it impales their self on a stick, if there's more people around, less, pe less people will, like, it's less of a chance that someone will go and help. Diffusion of responsibility. Yeah. But in Pili Armin et al's subway, sub subway um, experiment, actually they found that the more people there were, the more likely there was someone to help. Really? Yeah, mainly because they believed it was a confined environment, so you couldn't get away from the fact that somebody had just like fallen over and fainted. So you're like more likely to help because you can't physically get away from them. No. Oh, Obviously, because subway carriages in New York are quite small. <clears throat> Not compared to the big beasts of things we've got here. <laughs> I see you, baby. Yes, Shaking her ass. Mango, Shaking her ass. Always Shaking her ass. Mango. I see you, baby. <laughs> Bitch. Do you like my Dr. Pepper guys? Yeah, go and open it up. Dr. Pepper are owned by Coke. That's a weird fact. As really? a Fanta. Yeah. Are they? Mm -hmm. I feel like we need to inspect the label now. It says it's Where does it say it? Oh my god! A product of the Coca Cola Company. I'm not even filming the right bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so weird. That's a weird fact that I know. What, does Coca Cola own Pepsi then? No. Oh. That's PepsiCo. Oh, and they, they own loads of weird stuff, PepsiCo. But Coca Cola own Fanta and Pepper. Didn't Coca Cola own that water they named Spunk? <laughs> hey guys, do you know what <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just swallowed a bug. Oh, that was horrible. It just like flew into my mouth when I was breathing in. A spider landed in my hair earlier and it was scary. And Lewis started screaming and then I started screaming and I threw a pineapple lolly and then like. Mungo got all caught up and then like I was being, and then this spider was on my boob and then I was like flicking it and ow I just flicked my boob and then it went on my shoe and I was like kicking my shoe. <laughs> oh, I've done something. Okay. Charlie Sheen. Charlie Sheen. Is Charlie Sheen still alive? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Sit. What a shame. Stay. Stay stay. Oh, you've got water over your head. That's Aww. because I poured water on his head. <laughs> 
Not nice. Bad. Water balloon is thrown at my dog. Yeah, Lewis created a windsock. That's very weird. Mm. It's not a fact though. Well, I suppose it is. But... Oh, but yeah, it is. It's a statement. It's the truth. I did create a windsock. You have actually got 324 bones in your body. That's only joking. Really? No. Oh, how many is it? I know a weird fact. It's like 306, isn't it? Oh. 206 or something. <laughs> something in six. <laughs> okay, ready? This is a weird fact. Should I zoom in to make it no, no, more? No, no, okay. I'm fine zoomed out. I look better, right? Listen. Listen, guys. Okay? You know milk teeth? Lewis? Yes. Yes. You know milk uh, teeth? Yeah, I'm listening. Milk. What, like the little bones you have as a, yeah, as a yeah. child? The Your out. adult teeth are actually in the skull before they come through. They don't grow. Oh my god, Lewis, drop this in the car. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Lewis, drop that in the car. Yeah, I'm Why sorry. Just get me another one. Oh yeah, you can't really think of that. Go and swap it now. <laughs> I can't twist. Oh, okay, I'm just filming people's houses as well. Oh, I'm zooming into your nose. Look there. I'm going to place it in the windsock. Which is our bin. That's what's happening here every day. What do you put in your wind sock then? <laughs> wind sock. Aside from socks and wind. <laughs> I use it to store my Beatrix Potter books. Toad Hall and Jemima Puddle Duck. <laughs> Jemima Puddle Duck. Do you mind my puddle? Do you mind my puddle duck? What? <laughs> <laughs> I was like jumped over a really big Ouch. twig. <laughs> it's like a feeding a lamb, isn't it? I haven't got very much left in there, mate. It's all gone. Oh. That was really sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my god, that's all down my bra! I'll do a bit of fencing. I'm gone! Hey! Do you want to buy me another Dr. Pepper? <laughs> I think you should buy me another Dr. Pepper. Oh my god. I would have bought you a Dr. Pepper. How the hell did that even happen? What the hell? I think I know. <laughs> okay, guys, I think that's the end of this now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I guess I'll see you next Tuesday. Sorry about that randomness. If you Google Led Zebra, you'll find me. Led Zebra. Oh. LED Zebra. Uh, I love the Zebra. I love the 